a new season of X on the Beach came out tonight and I thought I would sit down and at least check out the first episode. Uh, I watched uh, one, I think just one season, the one where they were on, in, the, in the mountain and it gets pretty messy, pretty ridiculous. So I figured new season coming out, why not check it out? and why not maybe do a video on it. Uh, something, something new, you know, I don't know most of the celebrities or people who are on here. Uh, I, do, I do know one of the people who came out as our first set and, and that's Dave on. Uh, Rogers, who was on Big Brother, I think she was on two seasons of Big Brother and The Challenge, which I never watched her on. But I'll be honest, I was never a fan of her as a player on Big Brother, but uh, I'm 100% here for her just being on X on the Beach causing total chaos because let's be honest, that's, what, that's why we're tuning into this show. We, we want to see a messy, ridiculous situation and that is what this show delivers on. Uh, our other singles who are here for the experience were David from Paradise Hotel, Arise who is a uh, supermodel, Ray from Love Island, uh, uh, Ranin uh, who is apparently Carl Lentz's mistress, I don't even know what that means, and Darren from Double Shot of At Love. Uh, I would say the most interesting characters on this episode were definitely David, Aris, and Ray. Uh, we might as well start with Ray. Uh, he's from Love Island. Unfortunately, not a season of Love Island that I watched. I was really excited knowing that there was going to be a bunch of people from Love Island on uh, this season of X on the Beach. But of course, it's from the season I did not watch. Uh, r like right off the bat, we hit the table of truth and the more words that came out of Ray's mouth, the more I knew that it's going to be a very, very messy season for him. On top of that, everything that they were saying at the table of the truth was being listened to by our three exes who were already at the villa before anybody showed up. And of course, of course, one of them is Ray's ex, Caro, who uh, comes in and immediately gets the first drink throw out of the way for the season. She came in absolutely heated. Uh, she did cool off a little bit later and, and turned things around and forgave Ray to, so that she could kind of move on with her experience there. But, uh, you know, it was kind of nice to see basically Ray get totally busted for cheating and like nobody really buying his BS, but, you know, him still slowly starting to convince everybody that what he did maybe wasn't that bad. And then Carol comes out and chucks the drink in his face absolutely explodes and now I think Ray somehow managed to get in every single person on the show's doghouse so that was really interesting and uh you know I did a peek at the cast for, for like the exes and everything that's going to show up this season and I think it's going to be a very rocky ride for Ray. Uh, next up let's jump over to Aris and her her ex Mike shows up and you know it kind of went unnoticed because like the Carol blow up was so massive but once we actually started to dive into that, her, that relationship and also Mike's potential relationship with David things started to get real interesting you know an absolute love triangle forming right out of the gate because Arise said that, you know, she was interested in David. Uh, she's also interested in Mike. Mike's interested in David. I believe that is your classic love triangle. We just need now to get David interested in Arise and uh, things can get real, real messy. 
uh, uh, Mike, he, he did ha definitely have a makeout session with both Aris and David, just to further complicate things. Uh, we kind of ended the episode with uh, David, Renin, and Darren headed off to the beach for one of their exes to show up. And honestly, I'm really hoping that it's just not David's ex because I want to see that love triangle, you know, develop a little bit further before we start throwing uh, more curveballs into the situation. You know, let's see what happens with, uh, with David and Mike first before, you know, uh, David has to go off and deal with some other situation. Uh, the preview looked, the season preview looked just like we'd expect. Uh, lots of drama, lots of angry exes, uh, you know, people getting angry at each other. And I think that is kind of the whole point of X on the Beach. You know, I don't think that there's really the pretense that people are coming here to fall in love. Uh, people are coming here to get messy. And you know what? I'm, I'm here for a show where that's the expectation because I keep getting duped by all the other shows that lure me in with the false pretense of people falling in love for it to just be an absolute mess. You know, let's go into this. We're not looking for love. We're looking for the mess and let's get into it. All right, everybody, that's going to wrap things up for episode one of X on the Beach. As always, everybody, thank you so much for watching. And until next time, we will see you later.